Hello and welcome to Access Paranormal. My name's Jamie Williams. Joining me in the studio as usual is my co-host Jonathan Sullivan. Hello, Jamie. And this week we've even got Lee Arnold in. Hello, Jamie. Nice to see you, Lee. It's nice to be back. I know, and you be coming on more regular, won't you? Because you've actually um, changed jobs. I certainly have. Yeah. So Brilliant. that's great news yeah. and congratulations as well. Thank you very much. We haven't seen a street cleaned around here for years. I know. <laughs> I'm only kidding. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, it's great to have you back on, Lee, and I'm, yeah. I can't wait for you to actually be on on a regular basis. Yeah, it'd be great. Yeah. Yeah, and um, it's it's sad to see John leaving us. And I mean, <laughs> 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 no, it's great, and um, I can't wait to to have you on every week. Yeah, and um, this week we've got the second part of the show where we went off onto a graveyard. We can't say where or anything like that yeah. with Lewis and Louise, so that's going to be a good one coming yeah. up in a little bit of time. Yes, but um, let's see what you've both been up to, Lee. Yes. Have you watched anything on YouTube? <laughs> no, I haven't. That's the last time I remember going to ask you till next week. Good. <laughs> All right. To be fair, though, he's not being well. Has no, he? no, he's had the owl um, number 19, hasn't he? Yeah. 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 Not good. Anything to get a week off work or two, isn't it? Eh? Yeah, anything. Just. Yeah. <laughs> no, it's good. I'm, I'm glad that you've yeah. recovered as well. Oh, so, you know, yeah. I, I know that you were really ill. Yeah. I won't push so, that on anybody. No, no. Sure, God, no. And it, and you, but, you know, I'm glad you recovered anyway. Cheers. Um, only because, like, um, I'd have to put up with Jonathan even more. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, uh, God. But, uh, yep, yeah, so, Jonathan, have you watched anything on YouTube while we're here? Well, have I? Um, I've not really watched YouTube as such. Do you know what, though? You really built that up as well. Yeah. I'm getting to it. I'm getting to it. Go on, then. Just bear with me. And I, 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 well, I'm sure you'll have heard of this program, as everyone else in the world has. But I've just watched most of the Squid Game. I I've watched not, it. I know it's yeah. not paranormal, but I've got to talk about it. Well, then I'm up to epi- I've done episode five, so I've got to start the Squid Game. Left. Yeah, got a just left. just for the listeners, I've watched the whole lot of the Squid have Game. You? Yeah, and. It's it's fantastic. It's really good, isn't and it? And you've got to get past the first two two episodes yeah. and it gets into it. But I really hope that you've got a good stomach for it. it yeah, yeah. I, I like I like things like that. Yeah. So, so uh, Lee, yeah. Lee, if you haven't watched it, I don't know even know what it, it is. Do you know? No, I won't tell you what it is because then that gives away the game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Do you get it? Gives away the game. <laughs> yeah, right. no, would it give away the game? Um, yeah. But yeah, it's a must to watch anyway. It what is it definitely. It's on Netflix. Netflix, right? Okay. Yeah, but yeah. watch the first two episodes, get through that, and yeah. then it, go, it gets yeah. better. It's very, right. in, very. Yeah. Um, I'm going to say very intriguing. Yeah. yeah, different. Not very good if you're squeamish. No. Oh no, that's fine. No, if you're squeamish, mm. don't watch it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah that's but, yeah. just got to put that out there. Yeah. Yeah. But I, I had to get that mm. one in there. No, it's not yeah. paranormal, but. Yeah, no, it's all it's, right. Uh, yeah. yeah, it's it's like the trend and top program mm. in the world, I think, at the minute. Well, it is kind of spooky the way it's been done, anyway. It if, is, if you put it, it that is. way, it's, it's a bit creepy. It's, uh, it's yeah. gory. It, very it's gory. Yeah. 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 That's so watch. yeah, and I've been watching. I've watched a bit of YouTube. I've been watching. You know what you're supposed to be watching is paranormal stuff. Oh, uh, oh. So I've been hey. watching. Yeah. Yeah. You know what he's talking about, Lee. <laughs> No. Yeah, I've been watching. Um, I, I tried to watch the Paranormies one, and I won't mention who our broadband is, but it decided that it was going to go slower and slower and slower. So um, I missed quite a bit of it. So I went on to the others. And I, I was I wanted to watch the Paranormies one as well because, yeah. um, as I was telling you, they've, they've they've now been on there asking for people to support them and things like that yeah. because they're spending their own money. And do you know what? They do a good job, and I yeah. hope that somebody does pick up on that and support yeah. them. Because um, they, they are nice lads. So, yeah, all the best to them anyway. Yeah. Um, I've been, like, popping in and out of um, the... I can't remember them. Mind Seed, Mind but they're doing a thing at the moment, one every every night. Oh, right, okay. But it's, it's, it's like previous stuff. <clears throat> yeah. So I've been dipping in and out of that one 
And so then it's not pops up on my YouTube that one. No, just go and have a look on the the Mind C T V. I mean yeah, it's good. Look, yeah. It is good. It 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 brings back a few that the you know, when you think, Oh yeah, I remember that part. Yeah. I remember yeah, that. Yeah, they call the best bits. Yeah, that's exactly yeah. what it is, yeah. And then we went on to um normal T V as we would say. Yeah. And I watched a couple of the ghost adventures. Oh right, okay. Because uh, yeah, I yeah, I haven't yeah, watched yeah. them for a little bit and I thought, yeah. you know what? Let's let's have a watch they, of them. Um, so. They started yeah. putting some new ones up on a Friday now. Yeah, and the uh, they're doing the top tens and all that kind of stuff. Right, okay, yeah. Yeah, I haven't seen any of it, but I've just seen it like advertised when a flip station's yeah. over. Like, and yeah, quite a few different ones are doing it. Tell you what, I did see advertised on Facebook last night. What was that? Most haunted for YouTube. Oh, good. All oh, right. Yeah. Yeah. Nine p.m. YouTube. Yeah. So it must have been on at nine. Mm. I think it was late when I seen it, so I was wondering whether it was on at nine o'clock last yeah. night ah, right. which would have been Thursday <laughs> 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 or whether that was 9pm yeah. for tonight <laughs> <laughs> which is Friday for Sunday yeah, yeah. a week but, <laughs> and, and also have you seen what um, Haunted Scouts have put up did you see the did you see I the one on, on YouTube what they done did, yes. they gave us a really really good um, yeah, boost there didn't you great advertisement yeah. did you see it Lee where I they haven't now go on YouTube yeah um, it, it, you can get it online YouTube you can you know you can get onto <laughs> yeah. it we'll, sh- we'll send you a link to YouTube and you'll understand <laughs> you don't even it. have to register Lee <laughs> just go on it I'm already registered on that so I'm alright yeah we'll start watching it <laughs> <I can now. laughs> if I'm you're going to be a regular I'm mate you've got to start watching it. <laughs> <laughs> but no I've been watching um what was I saying Haunted then? Haunted Scouse. Haunted yeah. Scouse. I forgot yeah, it because yeah. I was telling Lee off. I know. I know. Um, and no, the little bit, the, yeah, the little, it was like a live, wasn't it? Uh, yeah, it was fantastic. Uh, I think it was their because first YouTube live. Because right, they've made it over because a thousand. A thousand subs. Which is f- thoroughly deserved. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Very well deserved. Yeah. Uh, yeah, but they, they gave us a good little laugh there. Right? They, they certainly did. Thanks, and, yeah, thanks, yeah, thanks to Chris and thanks to Adam. Yeah. Brilliant. Adam with the hair. Chris yeah. with the no hair. That's the one. So yeah, <laughs> but uh, you, you'll have to get to meet them, Lee. Yeah. The, the fantastic lads. Oh, We're going to be doing a few things with them as yeah. well. Yeah. Um, I think yeah, we're we'll meeting up with them soon. Yeah. Um, and um, I'm trying to think what we're doing. We're doing like a Christmas one for them. All right, They've asked yeah. me and Jonathan to do this Christmas one. Yeah. So why not? Brilliant. Yeah. You'll be yeah. working as usual. Well. Well, I hope not, but I you know, it. right. Well, you don't work anyway, you're always, you always you, you keep you don't work anyway, you get COVID. I don't know what he does though, he doesn't watch YouTube. Does oh he? yeah, I know. Do you know what he, he was off what how long were we off for? Ten days? Yeah. Ten days and he didn't even watch YouTube. No. I, I, I thought I was dying. That, and you think that's an excuse? Yeah. <laughs> Listen, you could have had YouTube on me. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> we're only kidding I know. I, know. I know and the sad thing is I mean we were just talking before we started doing this and you were saying I mean our group Ghost Quest at yeah. the moment we've we've had difficulty getting together with oh, yeah. you've got like Jane who goes to work you've got yeah. Lee and Leanne who goes to work well Leanne goes to work yeah. you've got um, <laughs> you've got Marie who's working yeah. and you've got you know and, 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 and Liz has been through a lot hasn't she and, yeah, yeah. Yeah, um, difficult, isn't it? Michelle, M- Michelle Cook, she does a lot of working as well. Yeah. Um, so and much, whoever, you know. I, if I've missed you out, I am so sorry. I haven't seen you for that long. I forgot yeah. who you are. Yeah. yeah. Uh, so, you know, and it'd be nice to just get us all back into the into the the paranormal and everything uh, else. Yeah. yeah. We just need to uh, get it all sorted out. I think. Yeah. We certainly get do. The gang back together. Yeah. Yeah, and, and but what's lovely to, to see though is other groups are out there and they're getting yeah. out and about, and yeah, we yeah. will be yeah. back. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, we're doing the um, we're, we're we're doing a sh- we're doing a Halloween special, aren't we? We are, we and are. Um, we're, we're doing one for charity. Yes, on the 29th of October. Yeah, uh, which is I think it's next week, isn't it? 29th of October. Yeah, next week. Yeah, after next, next week. How can it be the week after next? Next week. Next yeah. week. Yeah, you're. He's living on the wrong planet here, isn't he, Lee? Yeah. Yeah. Well, that's, that's why I'm glad you're here for the future, Lee. Well, cause... I'm looking at our clock and I'm wondering what day it is. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I've got to admit that the things are written on wrong on the wall, aren't they? So I am sorry. That's, I'll, I'll take the blame for it then, okay? Yeah, 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 yeah. 
Yeah. But um, yeah, 29th of October, we've got yeah. a charity event here at Mill Street Barracks. Yeah. With the tickets are selling really well. We've, yeah. we've I was going to say, there can't nearly, be many left there isn't, now, Jamie. There isn't. I think there's about five, maybe six left okay. of the tickets. Wow. And the night is full. Brilliant. Yeah. So it'll be a cracking night. You're there, Lee. I'm coming yeah, a bit later on. I'm there, yeah. Lee. <laughs> Jonathan's going to be the week before us or the week after us because yeah. he gets it wrong, doesn't he? <laughs> <laughs> so we'll, we'll all be all right. Yeah. Jonathan will be on his own that night. <laughs> He'll be waiting outside for us. I know, yeah, the, yeah, but the week after or the week before, I can't remember what he said now. Don't talk about being alone in this place. Why? Do you remember that little thing I told you earlier? Oh, oh yeah. Right. Off here, you were telling us, weren't you, about yeah. something that happened to you. Yeah. I'm going to hand that over to you now and you're going to tell us that story. Okay, then. So, I'm sitting there in my house, just, I don't know, daydreaming, mm -hmm. sitting there on my own, world of my own, and I, get, I don't know whether, well, I don't know whether it was a dream, a premonition, or mm. I don't know, whatever it was, uh, and it was me and you, Jamie, mm -hmm. in the barracks. That was a nightmare then. <laughs> was a nightmare yeah. but the nightmare is still to come <laughs> yeah <laughs> because we each done a lone vigil yeah and I went into the cellar on my own in the dark with my phone to record mm -hmm. and a walkie talkie to get in touch with you and I was sitting in the hallway outside the room that you don't like facing the stairs yeah so I was sitting there uh, I, th I think you were in the classroom or the bedrooms mm -hmm. so we were calling out each recording talking on the walkie talkies and then the next thing I remember is a woman coming towards me in the cellar um, dressed in like the like the royal blue and white yeah. nurse's uniform yeah uh, a portly woman should mm -hmm. kind of say um, and I've got my phone in my hand and I'm recording for, for like for the show um, so she's coming towards me she's talking to me yeah, I can rem remember this vividly. Yeah, it's what's straight. It's that's it's the strangest thing. I, w I wasn't asleep. That's the, the way. The yeah. strangest thing. Um. Now I immediately thought of Claire. Oh yeah. Being the nurse. So I asked her if her name was Claire, and she said yeah, it was. Yeah. And she's chatting away. Um, and I said, so are you the, the person that speaks to Jamie? you got a connection to Jamie. Yeah. Uh, is it you that turns the torches on and off and plays with stuff like that? And she said, yeah, it was. Wow. Um, at this point, I was on my walkie-talkie and I'm trying to get Jamie yeah. on the walkie-talkie yeah. and nothing's happening. I'm getting nothing back. Right. Um, so she's still coming towards me, yeah. and she's asking me to come with her to go and see the other spirits. Yeah. And she's beckoning for me to come towards her and to go towards the stairs. Yeah. And at this point, I'm getting a bit <laughs> um, edgy, yeah. shall I say? Yeah. So I'm in this cellar. I've got nowhere to go because she's in my way. I can't get Jamie on the walkie-talkie. Yeah. So I'm starting to panic a bit. Mm -hmm. um, I'll tell you what else there was as well in, in this. And there was someone else there. And she brought up... There was a woman, another woman. Yeah. That appeared. And she said, this is your grandmother. Wow. Right, I'd never, I didn't recognise her at all. Yeah, yeah. Not one little bit. Um, I asked her if I could record it on my phone. Yeah. Like video, and she said, "Yeah, you can." Wow. Um. And then I asked her if there was anyone else there, 
And she said there was people that were behind me. But I didn't want to look around. <laughs> but she still wanted me to go with her. Yeah. And then that was it. So would you reckon, I mean, that wouldn't be a dream because it's too, um, what, too, too, much. too much information because yeah. dreams, much it's sporadic, isn't it? Because you, you it only is. pick up hits and pieces where that, yeah. to me, is quite, I don't know what you think, Lee. It's a weird one. It's like, it's, a, like an out-of-body experience. It hits, you know, because I wasn't asleep. Yeah. This was like the middle of the day. Yeah. It's like the weirdest strangest creepiest uh, and you're thing at home. you're at home as well I was happens. at home I, I mean we haven't done nothing in the in the salary military for I don't know a couple of months we haven't have we not like properly like, not like properly not like just yeah, with ourselves yeah. we've been down there like with groups yeah uh, but we haven't actually done any of that ourselves that weird, it was like a really really like yeah. creepy do you know what I mean yeah, yeah. it's a bit eerie isn't it but it was the detail as well, though. Yeah. Especially, like, um, names and stuff like that as yeah. well. Yeah. Well, I left a little bit out there, didn't I? Because yeah. and I'm, I'm not going to say the name, but when I did ask her if it was Claire and she said, yeah. Yeah. But she goes, it's not actually her name. Her right. name is something else. Ah, Right. Related to Claire, I could say. I know you yeah. two know what yeah. it is. So it's sort of got Claire mm. in it. Yeah, yeah. So, in you, a way. Yeah, I know you told us the name, but what I, I yeah. said you don't mention it in case yeah. anybody else comes up with that name. Because yeah. if anybody else comes up with that name, that would be yeah. you know, yeah. mind-blowing, yeah. wouldn't yeah. it? But, I mean, I've not watched any like horror stuff. or. No, we know. We asked you. Yeah. And, do you know, do <laughs> yeah. know what I mean? It's... Yeah. It's it's a strange one to me. Mm. It is really, really. So I've never had that before. Yeah. Wonder if you start getting them a bit, a bit more often now. Then I don't know. Well, it'd be interesting if he did. Yeah. Mm. You, you know, because I know that sometimes you go to um, a, a thing at Mill Street Barracks, don't you, with Jill? Yes. Yeah, like the open uh, circle. And there. it's like yeah. yeah, the open circle. But maybe that's bringing you know more of it's coming out with you. Could be. Maybe it is, yeah. yeah. Maybe it is. It's just a very, yeah. uh, it's very weird. Well, and, and also we're here a lot as well, and we, we you know, we're concentrating on the paranormal uh, quite more yeah. than what we normally do. Yeah. And, which is good because yeah, we, we yeah, do yeah. enjoy it and everything else. Some you know things are looking up for us in in ways. Yeah. But the the thing is, is uh, do you remember me saying to you, and I've said it to Marie, and I'm not sure whether I've said it to you, Lee, is. Sometimes I keep seeing things, and I don't know whether it's in my mind or yeah. whether it's uh, I'm, oh, I'm yeah. seeing it like yeah. sh- movement, yeah. and I've seen figures moving. Yeah. But because we think logically, you think, well, maybe it's maybe I'm tired. Yeah. Mm. Maybe it's one of those things that you, you think you're seeing it, you, you've and you're seen, not. Do you, do, you, do you not see one when you were in your car driving? Yeah. In the middle of the day. Yeah. Wow. Uh, me and Marie, where were we going? Were we going to that's somewhere? not being tired, is yeah. it? No, I think we not. were going to Wigan or somewhere, and yeah. we were driving along, and, I, and we we were coming to a road junction, you know, cross not yeah. a crossroads, but like a road junction. And then on on the left, I was passenger then, and in the corner of me, I thought I saw someone walking on the path near the tree, but walking towards the path. Right. And then I went, did I just see that, or didn't? Was it just my imagination, or what? Yeah, playing tricks. And um. I still don't know, but I've said to me a few times that I've seen things like I'm, yeah. I'm. But I mean, I'm not. I'm not a person who's opened up or anything like that, yeah. and, and I'm always sceptic about things, and I think logically as much as I possibly can. But um, I was talking to Jill, yeah, um, who's the medium who, who does a lot here at Mill Street Barracks, yeah, yeah. and uh, such a really nice la- lady. Well, actually, she's lovely. coming on the show. Yeah, that yeah. blended in quite well, then, didn't That's it? Really, it? yeah, That's fun, that. not bad. So um, I was talking to her and I said to her, I said, I, I fancy coming along to your, to your nights. Yeah. I've office. never done it before. I've never wanted to do it. I'd never done it before. But I, I mean, I've, I've heard from you how good she really is oh. and how she, she you know, supports yeah. you. Yeah. So I just want to go along. I, I've, I've always avoided it. I've always yeah. tried. Nah, yeah. nah, I can't be bothered. Nah. Mm. But I think now I, I want to do it. Yeah. I want to go along yeah. and see. It might not be for me. It might, I might get there and go, no, this isn't for me. Yeah. Yeah. But you know you what? Why should, I, why should I not try? Yeah. Because it's an yeah. experience. 
and it's something we can we can talk about as well and especially yeah. when jill comes in yeah. i've just had a massive breeze go right across my face like oh right yeah if i do that yeah it's not there but that was a breeze breeze oh, okay. and it's funny that we were talking and that yeah and the doors yeah. closed and doors closed and everything else yeah we're, we're like in just sitting here, here talking yeah but that was that was a, a, a quick right across my face as if it blew in me for there again hold on no it wasn't me um, but anyway we'll carry on yeah. if things yeah. happen yeah. fantastic yeah. You know. yeah. I was going to say put the Ouija board on the table but last time that happened you said I got affected so it, that, um, that was a strange one yeah. no very Le- very strange where they are. yeah so what we'll do is we'll leave it where it was you're right there Lee but um, we'll be going across to the um, to the graveyard in a minute but what I'm going to tell you to do now is if you've got headphones plug your headphones in because this next part after the adverts is going to be in 3D. So I hope you'll enjoy it. It's the final part of our trip to the graveyard. If you'd like to join our Facebook community, why not search for Access Paranormal Radio Podcast? There's always something very spooky going on on the Access Paranormal Facebook page. (laughs) <laughs> this is very dark here isn't it it's very yeah. very atmospheric as well so that might be playing on my mind a bit let's move in towards we're still on the path aren't we yeah we're on the path this is a good path to walk down it's it's, it's taking us off the light isn't it really yeah maybe that's what they want yeah it's easier to get in touch when it's less light wow what what was that did that go across then I thought it was something behind me then did that go across that way I thought that, yeah that's why I went yeah. what was that I thought I saw something ok let's try because we've got a big tree in front of us <laughs> Um. Oh, I've just seen a flash of light again. Where? It's over there, just behind the tree. I know there's lights in the distance. I can see no, a no, light no. in the it distance. It was just. Yeah. It was about six feet past the tree. Right. But behind it. This is a good spot here, isn't it? Yeah. Let's see him. Um, oh, what am I treading on? Oh, on the grass. Is that what it is? Yeah. I forgot about the grass, but yeah. Mm-hmm. That was nice. Oh, big Okay, because we're in now. Where we are, there's one, two, there's three, areas. one, two, three, is it three pathways, four pathways? One, two, there's four. Four pathways all leading to like a circle of grass. So we all just watch one way. Yeah, all watch a path, path each. So I've got, which path are you doing Louise? Well, that one I feel like I'm going to see something. Okay, Jonathan, which one are you looking at? I'll, I'll look straight ahead. You look down that one there and I'll look down this one here. Look that one and I'll look the one we came up, yeah. Okay, and I'll do a call out now. Yeah. Ooh, okay, I'm going to ask if there's somebody here with us now. If you want to walk towards us, you're more than welcome to. Please come towards us. Show us who you are. Or tell us who you are. If you wish to make contact with us, we really don't mind. We'd love you to. Come on, come forward. Lewis, do you want to call? Can you please show us any light to make sure we know that you're here? Or touch us on the shoulder, maybe? We mean you no harm. We hear with respect. Do you want to try Jonathan as well? Yeah. Come on, come on board towards us. Walk amongst us. I'll show you something if you can. Hey? Hey? I've just seen a light go across the floor here, like a faded light go across. I've just seen a little shadow there. I've just seen a shadow go behind the grey. What was that, Jonathan? Tesco. Flashing? Batteries going. They're like new batteries. Louise, do you want to call? 
the heel of his back, bicep key on the shoulder or on the head again, like before. Pull it forward to the other one. I've got a finish in. No, battery's gone on this chain. Is it? Yeah, it's on the swing of the cars. That's unusual. That's strange, isn't it? Yeah. It's just the booty and obviously not the phone is not in there. It's just the... It's just gone off. Well, it's still on, but it, it just won't be covered now. It just keeps going off, same battery as long. And you were fine? No, not before. Yeah. No, that's never gone off like that before. <coughs> and we checked them before we came out. It is. It is. Plenty of battery life in there. Okay, we'll keep going with this anyway. Yeah. I'm going to ask yeah. if there's anybody here. Sorry, what was that, Lewis? It's definitely a shadow over there behind one of the girls there. They went left after. I've not seen it since. But I can hear footsteps over there as well. I'm going to make a cup of my head. Higher. Well, anything can come from any pathway, can't it? Because there's yeah. four, four pathways along this. Yeah, uh, I'm going to walk this way again to the pathway again. If you just drain the battery. You're around me now. I'm getting cobwebs all over my head and my face. Is that you? I'm really cold on my left hand side. I know we're outside and everything else. But how can you be cold on one side of your body and not on the other? Yeah. I'm colder on my right side than the left. Is that you that's affecting us now like that? It's gone now. Weirdly, weirdly enough man's dissipated too. You walk down one of the paths. Let us see you. Let's hear your footsteps. Talk to you. Yeah. Be able to see you. That light wasn't flashing as fast as that before, was it? Mm. What light? That light over there, you see? That wasn't flashing nowhere no. near as fast as that before. Oh, right. Uh, that might be just the wind. And we're not anywhere near where you can get cobwebs neither. Yeah. I'm just going to turn round. What was that? All three of you have pointed to the same way. I heard it twice. I just. Can you come? Can you come forward if that's you? But the more we look in one area, it'll be in a different spot. So I'll use the look in the other one that's quite loud. Yeah. you see a red light in the distance? No. But there's, there's trees just there, isn't it? So it might be... You see a red flashing light in the distance. There's a light on the back, It's like, it's stopped flashing now and it's just moving side to side. Someone's just turned the light on them. It might no, be the no, house. I'm on about the red light, I'm not on about the oh, thingy the light. The I can't that, even see a that, red light. That was flashing. And now it's just circling. I can't even see it. Oh, right, I can see it now. That was flashing just then, it's not now. That looks like it's in someone's house, that, because it's right close to the houses. Mm. I've never known anyone to have red light. Yeah. Straight down, Jonathan. Oh, no. If you come to come in front of me, and you can see the red light. That path. Which path? It's gone even darker than what it was. Right, come on, let's go down it then. There's there's something strange about tonight in here. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah. It's more active than it usually is. Yeah. No, I've walked through here and I have felt like I'm being watched, but it's never been proper heavy walking on twigs. Was it? Twigs. Has anyone ever walked? Does anyone want to walk ahead? Oh, cover again. I've just got that at the back of my head. Do you want me to walk ahead a little bit? Come on, see what that does. Yeah. Well, we know what's in front of us. Just don't disappear. Ah, yeah. <laughs> oh, right, I know where we are. Yeah, yeah. I know where we are, yeah. It's usually an active area, this anyway. Yeah, it is. But what we'll be doing in a minute, we'll be going, for the last part of this, we'll be going somewhere mm -hmm. and see what what happens. I think I know more or less where you are. Yeah, I don't want to say where we are so no. we don't give away where yeah, we are. That's fine. Jonathan, last time we were here, oh, I don't remember. this was really good, wasn't it? Yeah. Okay, let's go for Should it. Go just about here. Was it about here? Yeah. Yeah, it's just about here. It's where you've seen something go through the door, come out. Came out from from there. Uh -huh. Across. And we thought it was you. Uh -huh. It wasn't. Because you were still down the other side. That's right. And the capos were going off here as well. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to ask if there's anybody here with us now. Please come forward. There's nobody here to be afraid of. Could you let yourself be known? Come and talk to us. Could you tell us your name? around and you show yourself you go past in the distance you hear your footsteps walking I thought I saw movement over there, then I in the corner of my eye. I thought it was awesome. Well, that's where we'll be going in a minute anyway, so that, that's... That makes sense. Mm. I see the cars in the distance. I know we can hear the leaves dropping. Let's go around the other side slowly. If you are here, come and talk to us. Oh, it's a bit windy here. Yeah. Okay, we're on the other side now, if you can talk to us or show us where you are, don't be afraid of us. Make us. I've seen a white light just, just there, big bright one. It would like, you know the way it like shoots up in the air. Just that. Just there, yeah. As you've just said that, my right shoulder's gone ice cold. Was that you just then? Can you do it again? When we first came here, it was really, really dark. It's gone light. And, yeah. yeah. And it's not because our eyes have adjusted, it just seems really light. I'm just in a flash of light down there. Not, down not there. the light that you can see, but in between the trees. And over there as well. It's strange because it is really, really Mm -hmm. I know our eyes have adjusted and everything, but it was much darker than this before. It Come and talk to us. It could be that way. Well, no, it's not, is it? Because we've walked we all around. Yeah. 
what we'll do then is we'll just give it one more call out just here Jonathan yeah. um, Lee, Lee Louise and um, then I'll take you to where I want to try for five five minutes or so mm -hmm. okay let's try here because didn't we get some reaction here as well Jonathan yeah, it was, it was like yeah. okay if there's somebody here with us now Come on, come forward. We really don't mean you any harm. It's funny how you're looking all around the place, isn't it? Yeah. Hmm? Something behind Louise, hmm. Are you here with us now? Can you show yourself? Do you want to talk to us? Maybe jump then. Nobody around. I'd yeah, say there's someone around with that. That's a car. That's a car, yeah. Yeah, let's keep an eye on that. Why is that in here? Yeah, is it coming to us? Yeah. Is it? No, they, they can't get up this way. Can't they? No, I don't think so. Hmm. Okay. Makes me wonder, you know. Where's it going? There's a car park not far down there. That's coming this way. Okay, let's walk around. Is that a bit strange, that? Mm -hmm. It's coming this way. Mm. It's alright, it's not going to do us any harm. We're just walking through and recording, aren't we? Don't, it's all right. It's not doing us any harm. Let's just see. If it's coming towards, we'll just say where we are. Bright. Okay. You could actually drive through here, Crystal. No, I didn't. No, that was a bit strange for the car to come through here the way it is. Hmm? Right. Sorry, I was just curious. Of, I know we're on a paranormal investigation, but I was just curious about that car. Can we try walking in that direction? Um, well, we can't go where we want to, where I want to go for the next five minutes because with him having full beam on. It's um, it's quite bright, isn't it? He stopped. Has he stopped? Mm. He's carried on now. It's almost like he doesn't know where he's going. I'm surprised that he's allowed to drive around here. For the listeners, we do apologise for this. Um, it's just a bit strange that there's a car driving around this graveyard. Don't know what they're doing or anything like that. So we will be going where we wanted to go in a minute. Just want to make sure that these are okay. Okay, he's gone, hasn't he? Yeah. You must know the place for him to drive around like that, though. That's okay. Get in now, no, I didn't. I knew there was something because you could hear the the bangs. Right, what we're going to do now is we're going. We're not that far from where we want to go. Um, and we're just making sure everything was all right with that car going round. Okay, what we're going to do now is just go through here for the last part.
I can't say where we are or anything. Hello? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm walking along and talking to you and you're nowhere near me. Sorry, David. No, you're alright. What we'll do is we'll go up here. Where I'm going, um, Jonathan, and that'll follow me in a minute. Yes, there's a grave in the middle of this garden or field on its own. Um, last time I was here, or a time before that, probably, we picked something up. And that was the one that was saying my name. Was it? So, yeah, just here. How did you get so close to me so quickly then? Um, quick. We won't read it out, but if you want to have a look at what it says. Okay, no, if you want to read it. So it's an interesting plot, isn't it, this one? Yeah. Okay, I'm going to ask if there's anybody here with us. Are there any children around? Don't be afraid of us, we're not here to harm you. We just want to say hello. Come and play if you want. Now, just for the listeners, where we are is one big massive field with one grave in the middle of it. Um, work out yourselves what you want from that. So I'm going to ask if there's anybody here, anyone who'd like to come forward. What's that? Did that sound like footsteps to you? Yeah. That what like about you, Jonathan? Sounded like running through the pine over there, but Lewis said to me, there's something going across where you're looking. That's why I turned round, because it sounded like it was going from one... It ran, it ran from the left to the right. To the right, yeah. yeah. I hope that's picked it up on the, um, the audio. I'm going to ask again if there's somebody here. If that was you... Could you do that again? Come on, come forward. We've got a lot of respect for you, everybody here in this area. We don't mean you any harm. Would you like to give us a message? Would you like to walk towards us? Can you show yourself? Can you hear it? Yeah. Yeah, that car's coming back. What we'll do then is we'll leave it there and we'll start making our way back. Um, I'll keep recording. There it is. Yeah, that's a motorbike. Must be a knife for riding around in this. Yeah. Right, it seems like the, the the cars are coming around. I don't know why. Cars and a motorbike. So what we'll do is we'll call that now. Um, I'll ask you, what did you think happened there, Jonathan? What did you think? Uh, I think it was really good, actually. Yeah. It's a bit of activity. Yeah. Um, Louise got a bit emotional, but... I'm still feeling it now. Like oh, yeah? Cry. Yeah, like I just want to cry my eyes out. Well, I'll tell you what that was in a bit when we get back. When we stopped recording. I just um, felt like, like putting flowers down and hugging it and yeah. like making it lovely, do you know what I mean? It's weird. Right, well, I'll tell you what it is when we've gone off here. Yeah. Um, what do you think about, about tonight? Yeah, that, it, was, it was quite active throughout the whole investigation. Yeah. Most, some areas more than others. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Well, it was all, yeah. It was, it's, it's the misted areas as well that, mm-hmm. that, that, that was very interesting because it was misty, but then it got pitch black. 
Yeah. But then when we came over there, it lightened up. It, yeah. You, you can't explain that. Because... And it was, it was, I mean, from the minute we walked in here, it was a bit eerie. I've just seen something behind me move then. Is it? Ah, it could be the light flashing across the trees here. Yeah, they won't. Now, I mean, it was a one-off thing, wasn't it, Jonathan? We just decided to just come out tonight because it was a lovely, clear night. Yeah. Lewis and Louise were celebrating their first year anniversary, and what a way to celebrate it in the, in the graveyard. Yeah. <laughs> eh? Well, when you put it that way. <laughs> well, it's true, isn't it? <laughs> but yeah, ideas. We, yeah. But thank you for coming anyway. No, thank you. I thoroughly yeah. enjoyed that. Just there. Where? I feel like there's something in front of me. There's a like tree. A is that a tree there? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah it's, it's a tree. Just making sure. Yeah. Cause it, yeah. I can see off. Right, and on that note, sure. what we'll do, Jonathan, yeah. we'll go back to us two in the studio. Yeah. Okay? So, Louise and Lewis, thanks for coming. Thanks for scaring the living daylights out of me outside Mill Street. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Thank you. And I hope you have the, the rest of the evening. It's a good one for your anniversary. Thank you very much. Thank you. You're welcome. Jonathan, over to us in the studio. That was a really good night, that, wasn't it, Jonathan? Thoroughly it enjoyable. It was good. And it, thanks to um, Lewis and Louise for joining as well, otherwise it would have just been the two of us. Hello, yeah. <laughs> in the, in the, I can imagine that. In the graveyard all alone. Uh, it, was, um, it was a kind of a spooky night, but... Uh, and I'm recording it in 3D, 3D as well, audio. That was brilliant. Really yeah. enjoyed doing yeah, that. It was good. It was, good. Yeah, it was so quite active, wasn't it? We had quite a few noises. Oh, God, yeah. yeah. Um, you you so seen something? I've seen something, yeah. yeah. Um, there was definitely something where we, we were at that little crossroads. The crossroads, crossroads. Oh, yeah. 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 And that was the right was that where we were in the, in the circle? In the circle, yeah. And there was and like four or five paths. And, and Louise went one way, Lewis went the other, you looked at the other one, and I yeah. looked at the other one. Yeah, and yeah. Then that's where the task comes out, on me. That's right, it went dead. Yeah, which it's never ever done before. No. The batteries were fine. Um, and you know, task comes are likely. Yeah, yeah. Uh, the batteries just died on it. And they were right. brand new batteries fitted in them. Yeah. It's mad, isn't it? So that was a bit strange. Yeah. Now the funny thing is, I used them as well. Yeah. And they were fine, absolutely fine. And we've never ever had a task cam do that. Yeah, never. It's unusual that. Yeah. It is. And usually when you put them batteries in, they last seven, eight hours yeah, of, of continuous recording. Yeah. We've never had yeah. an issue with that. No, no, never. So, yeah, so that was uh-huh. a bit strange. Um, I think we thought we saw something there as well coming down one of the paths. Which, which um, one's that? Sure, what I can't. May have been Lewis. Oh, have Lewis! When we first started, you mean? Or no, was that on that crossroad? Oh, yeah. He, he yeah. thought he'd seen something coming towards us. Yeah. Yeah. And then a few seconds later, you should hear it on. You should have heard it before. You'll have heard a twig snap. A snap. Yeah. Twice. Yeah. One very loud. There was no one there. There was no one. No one at all. It was near enough right in yeah. front of us. And like, uh, uh, I wouldn't have said there was trees. So it was like a bit of a clearing, really, wasn't yeah, it? Yeah, it was. Yeah. Um, off to the left hand side, more your side, but in front of you where mm-hmm. you stood. Um, definitely, it sounded like a person had yeah. stood on a twig and snapped. Well, you it. know the difference when. Yeah. yeah. Oh yeah. God, yeah. yeah. And the the funny thing is, Lee, is we all saw things or felt yeah. things on that night. It yeah. was very, very strange. Yeah. Very yeah. eerie. It so certainly it was. That was good. Yeah. Really good. It was, and it wasn't, there was no wind neither. There was not a breath of wind yeah, in, in places. Very, uh, it was a very, very Surreal calm, and calm. Yeah. yeah. And still nice. Apart from the sirens that were going. Oh, God, yeah. <laughs> but the funny thing was is, th- this car came up. Yeah. Oh, yeah. We thought at first we were going to get asked what he was doing and that. Yeah, yeah. But uh, no, it was just a couple of lads driving around in the car. It was just a bit naughty of them to drive around the way they were. They were driving around yeah. quite fast in places. Oh, yeah. And they disappeared, and then the motorbike come flying around. Yeah. Jeez. Yeah. No, I mean, you, you, you know that graveyard. Yeah, itself. of course, yeah. Um, never seen any. I've never seen sort any. Sort of vehicles at that it. time no. of night. No, definitely not. Never? No. So, it's unusual, that. Yeah. Very. 
but we went to a couple of places. We had a walk around, didn't we, yeah. and everything else. Yeah. Um, and there was, a, there was an area where you sat down, and I said, oh, I'm going to have a walk up there. That's right. And I went yeah. up on my own into yeah. where these trees were, and it felt really uncomfortable. I, f- I thought that I saw somebody to a, a side of me, and I was thinking, what, what's that? Yeah. And then I looked around, and... Um, Jonathan Lewis and Louise were, yeah. were quite a distance away from me. I could see them, but I thought he was one of the, especially um, Lewis. I thought he was going to play games, sneak yeah. up and frighten me. Yeah. But then I thought I can see them. Yeah. And then Lewis came up to me, didn't he? Yeah. And it still didn't feel right. So we ended up the four that was in this circle. Yeah. yeah. And we were all sensing things. We 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 didn't feel as if we were on our own. Mm-hmm. Well, it's when we were sitting on that wall. Um, to the left but further back we seen a light a couple of times when we walked up to where you were and you saw to there was like bushes lying on the path yeah yeah but there was nothing behind no at all that could have given a light yeah. off and I know there was little lights dotted about on some of the graves and yeah. stuff yeah but there was no graves in that direction. There wasn't. There was nothing. So I don't know where the lights yeah. came from. Yeah. And the funny thing was is, I mean, we know that graveyard quite well. Yeah. And there was a part where we we totally got lost. Oh, yeah. We didn't even know where we were. Wow. Yeah. And I know that grave, like yeah. the back of my hand. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's, oh. it's a place where I go quite often. Yeah. And um, I just couldn't work out where we was. Just like dis- not disorientated. Yeah, so we we ended up walking until we found him. And I went, oh no, where we are now. Yeah. yeah. But even even Lewis said, oh, I, I know this. I, I know where I am, and this, that, yeah. and the other. And he even he was like, well, where are we? Yeah. We it's didn't cool know where we were. Very weird. That weird. And then well, coming back out. The light as well, JB though, because it was quite. It was pitch black. Well, when we went, none of us had to touch. Yeah. Yeah. Jamie. Oh, you won't need a torch, it's quite light. <laughs> <laughs> like part, but part, it was strange though, wasn't it? Because as soon as we went it, in there. Yeah. It was pit, went pitch black as soon as we went in. Yeah. Jeez. But then, as we were further in, there was a part, it was just so bright, it was like daylight. Yeah. But there was no You could lights. see everything, yeah. It's unusual, that. Yeah. It's weird. Yeah. And that night, there was, there was no, you couldn't see the moon. No. It, that, you know, because it was yeah, cloudy night, yeah. um, you could not see the moon, and that was the good thing about it. It was it, the cloud covered the moon as well, so it was, yeah. it was totally. We were in to. Do you know, that is so creepy. That isn't yeah. it? I know it's just people walking past yeah. the, the the building, and we've got the door open to the studio, and it's quite loud. Wow. that was kind of good. Well. It, before we go back to the subject, a little bit earlier on, before we, we um, started all this, there was two huge screams, wasn't yeah. there? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. And the funny thing is, is we're going to be going down into the cellar yeah. in a little bit. Um, so yeah. just a quick warning is, when we when we start going into the cellar, we are, we are recording it in binaural. Yeah. So uh, we advise you to put your headphones on because you'll feel as if you're in there with us. Um, and that'll be coming up in about five minutes' time. So grab your headphones, get yeah. them on your head now, even though we're talking, because once we get going, it'll all be in three D, three D audio, yeah. and it it sounds good, like like the pre, like the very first part of the show with the yeah. the um, what we're talking about now yeah. is that was in three D, but we're in the cellars yeah. at Mill Street Barracks. Yeah, going back a, a quick one over the um, the, the graveyard. It was a bit of a, a strange night as well. We didn't feel as if we were on our own. And no puns there, please. Yeah. <laughs> we know we weren't on our own, right? But we, we felt as if we were being followed in places. Oh, yeah, definitely. Yeah, most definitely were. Mm. Yeah. And then we, we all, uh, which is unusual, but we all felt something or seen something. Yeah. All yeah. of us. All right. And especially in one part where we stopped. Yeah. We, st- I, mean, we I think we were there for a good ten, fifteen minutes. Yeah, that was on that little pathway, wasn't it? Yeah. And you, you and stood there. Definitely things moving behind you. 
you were saying that wasn't you yeah. and there was just a very very and, and there was like a heavy feeling as if something was close yeah and i think you saw Shame something moving as well didn't you and yeah. at the same time i think lewis or lose lewis louise said the yeah, same God, i can't same, even get same. a name right <laughs> yeah. but and a mist. it was great hmm? a mist yes in that area yeah 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 there was a mist but it was nowhere else wow and so we couldn't explain it yeah. no and it wasn't because it was just like it was open part with no trees yeah and it was there was other open yeah. parts with no trees where we were it'd be, it'd be there, there was well. no mist there either oh. but it, it, it was there and you know it wasn't cold to no. make a mist there no. was no mist no. i mean we when we were talking we couldn't see our breath so it wasn't so, you know yeah, it wasn't it to the point where the mist is and we oh. we know that there's field mists and everything yeah, else but this was definitely not a field mist yeah. then all of a sudden it just vanished didn't it it was it yeah. was crystal clear wow strange so i'm hoping that the listeners out out there enjoyed that little bit of an investigation yeah. and um what we'll do in a second then is i'll, I'll just set up because we're going to do it in 3d yeah and in a moment we're going to make our way down. do you fancy doing the cellars then or what yeah, you're looking at each why, other there why yeah not? i don't mind yeah yeah I'm, been down there for a while no we haven't no it's been a while hasn't yeah. it since we were last there so what we'll do is um do you want to go now let's go for it Why yeah not? so what i'll do is that we're going to go across to the 3d audio any second now so you'll probably pick this up all in 3d so please if you've got your headphones on now's the time to put it on because what we'll do then is i think we'll head down yeah to the cellar and have a little bit of an investigation because we haven't done the cellar for a while to be no. honest with you have we no we haven't and um all i'm doing is i'm killing time here so the listeners can put their headphones on they'll all be like rushing down oh, i've got to go to the toilet first oh, yeah, like that so said what are you looking what before we start heading down there what what is it you're expecting from there tonight because there is only cause there is only three of us isn't we've, there we've not been down there for a we've not been down there for ages like yeah I don't mind anything. Oh no. Yeah. Well, to an extent, Lee, to an extent. Yeah, to an extent. <laughs> you're scared of a shadow? Yeah, true. Yeah. <laughs> what yeah. are you expecting, Jonathan? I don't know, to be fair. Uh, I'm expecting. I'm expecting to see movement tonight. Oh, yeah? yeah? Maybe some noises. I don't know why, but I'm just expecting mm. to see some movement. Yeah. Well, I'll tell you what, everyone should have had their headphones put on by now. Yep. So should we leave the studio yep. and head towards the, um, the cellars? So yep. let me yep. just get up off the chair. Just take the headphones off. And um, yeah, let's head down there because that should be good fun, shouldn't it? Now, yep. you should be in full 3D audio now because um, we're moving away from the actual... Um, we're, we're actually moving away from the studio. We're in the studio, but we're making our way down there now. You've got the torch. Yeah, we have the yes, torch. Right. Yeah. That's okay then. I'm a bit concerned about this, but hey, let's go for it. Let's just shut the door. You just look like look and sounded a bit nervous there. You two? No, no, we no, no. Sounding? You're silent. We were just saying. Yeah. Um, if we put the chairs in the main hall part where the exit light is and do this do that see if we can pick up on any shadows yeah why not so we're just going down the steps or the stairs here from the studio in the main hall here at mill street barracks now jonathan's just going to open the door at least it wasn't a creaky door jonathan yeah, yeah thankfully um there has been a couple of people down here tonight while we were recording the show so uh, maybe the energies are up. Jonathan's going first, Lee second, <laughs> and I'm last. It's only us. <laughs> bit chilly down here, isn't it? It's cold. Isn't it? Yeah. Oh, going past that room on my own then. Ooh. Ooh. What? Sorry? Yeah, yeah they, were, they were doing experiments, weren't they? Mm. 
Um, we've got a friend of mine listening in, somebody who I knew from the old street there, the old road. Um, Sharon McGrath. So we were talking to um, Sharon McGrath, and I've seen her for years, All right, yeah. a couple of years, and I bumped into her and she was oh, we're telling about the radio show we were doing, and she's listening in. So Sharon, hi if you're listening in, I'm with Jonathan and Lee. Is that where you're putting it? I hope you're listening to this in the 3D, 3D audio. I'm not having my back to that over there. Switch. To that door, to that. Um, I'll just sit here where Lee is. Did you fetch a camera? No. Oh, sorry. I didn't bring the REM pods neither. Do you want to run up for them? Do I want to run up for them? Are you having a laugh? Let's so just me, go so with... Shall me and Jonathan go for them? Hey? Shall so me and Jonathan go for them? Are you having a laugh as well? <laughs> hey. I'll leave me down here on my own. That's good, are you? Yeah. I'll leave you my phone. So that's going to help, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> I'll tell you what. Shut this door. Yeah. Are we going light out, are we? Or... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, it's cold down here, I'll tell you. Do you want to put your back this way? No, no, because sure? yeah, because I want to watch you too because I don't trust you. It's really cold, isn't it? Yeah. Right. Nice. Right, so tell me when you're ready. Yeah. Um, I'm yeah. not ready. Yeah. yeah. Lights out. Okay. And Ooh. it is real, nice. really, really dark. And you can see behind me anyway, aren't you? Yeah. yeah, a little bit. Yeah. Okay, so I've got Lee on my right, and I've got Jonathan on my left. Yeah. And I'm just going to give a call out now. So if there's anybody here with us now, anyone who can hear me or see me, there's only three of us here and we're not going to do you any harm. We're just here to talk to you. Would you like to come forward? Would you like to make a sound? Or if you can make some lights... You don't need to be afraid of us, you know who we are, we're always here. So I heard something then. Is that your chair? Whose? Yours. Jonathan's. No. Right, so we've got... I'm going to ask again if there's anybody here with us now. If you can, please come forward. Please let us know you're here. Sorry. Can you make, can you copy me? Anybody feeling anything yet? No, not yet. What about you, Jonathan? Um, can mainly feel the cold. I've just seen <laughs> something. Yeah, I think we can all feel the Fire cold. Fire range entrance. Well, I've got me back to that, haven't I? Yeah. If there's anybody around us now, if there's anybody on the stairs, but if anybody can move towards us, we'd really appreciate it. You've got Jonathan, Lee, and myself, Jamie. Please come forward. You're only waiting for something to happen now, you. I'm watching for shadows and things like that. Yeah, same here. Well, go on, Lee, you give a call out. Yeah. If there's anybody here, can you knock on something for us? Or do anything in your own way to let us know you're here? We haven't been down here for a while. 
I would like to see you or hear you. Can you just let us know whereabouts you are? What was that? I heard that. If that was you, thank you. Can you do it again, please? Keep thinking they're hearing voices. Someone's talking. Can you hear it? Yeah. What about you, Jonathan? No. Must be over your side then. If that's you talking, can you speak a bit louder so we can hear you? You know when you get the feeling that something's here? Yeah, you can tell. Yeah. I'm, I'm looking at the stairs and I don't know whether it's my eyes adjusting, but I thought I've seen movement near the stairs. Can you tap on something? Just to show us where you are. Can you tap on a wall like this. Can you show us some lights? Show yourself in any sort of light form. Would that be a bright light or a shadow? Come on, please come out and talk to us. Let's introduce yourself ourselves again. This is over here is I'm Jonathan. I'm Jamie. I'm Lee. Are you able to tell us your name? Is that noise? Come on, don't be shy. Come forward. Come and join us. What's that? Master man. I thought I saw a shadow above us then. You know, move. Yeah. And it's completely dark up there, isn't it? You know, when you look up, it's, yeah. it's, it's dark. What was that? I heard that. It's from behind you. It was right in me right here. In your right here? Yeah. Hello? I've got good, I've gone goose bumpy. Hello, have you come forward to talk to us now? We, we appreciate it. There's something here. I was just going to say, it feels like something's here. Between you two? Yeah. Yeah. Are you able to tell us... Can you tell us your name, please? I'm seeing like shadow movement now. There's movement behind you, Jamie. Is there? Yeah. Could the person behind us, can you come forward to us and let us know you're here? Yeah, I'm seeing things now. Whether it's just my, my mind or what, I don't know.
What was that? I don't know. I heard that. I heard a very faint. Why don't you just want to call out? What's that? Hmm? Sorry, it's fine. Are you with us now? I just seen the shadow. Where? Did you see that? Down here. Where, Lee? Just at the side of Jamie. Like, is there a fire extinguisher on the wall or something there? Or a sign or something on the wall? Yeah. Did Say it again. Oh my god. What is it? I... On that wall. The wall by me. Okay. If that's you, me, like, you yeah. to... I'm going really yeah. cold and, and bump. Twice. What's that? What's that noise? I don't know. Hello? We don't mean you any harm, we just want to know who you are, that would be appreciated. We've come here to, with the greatest of respect and we want that back. Is that you moving around us, are they your shadow? Or is that your shadow, sorry? Can you tell us your name? Is it possible for you to do that? How are you feeling now, Lee? Um, I feel a bit on edge. What about you, Jonathan? Uh, quite on edge, because I've seen that shadow. Yeah, it was sort of next to me, it was to my right. Yeah. I've seen it going behind the back of your chair, Jonathan, and it went along there, and then it shot back again. Yeah. It sort of went over to... Just, uh, so I sort of ran over towards Jamie. Yeah. Across the hallway. But it was on the wall and oh god. <gasps> I can see it. Yeah, it's back. It's there, it's between me and Jonathan just then. Thank you. Are you able to show us more of that? Could you tell could you tell us where you are for the listeners? It I mean, I've got Jonathan to my left, Lee to my right, and we are literally seeing the shadow. It was on the floor just then. We know it's not we we know there's a light at the back, but there's no way that's a spider. No. Because we, we you we've seen the spider one many a times and that is not a spider. Thank you for coming forward, we do appreciate it. What was that? Did you see that then, Lee, before? No. Ooh. Can I ask again if there's somebody here with us now, which we know there is. We'd like to ask. I've just seen movement again on the left hand side on the floor. Just caught my eye. Okay, we know you're here and we really appreciate what you're doing. If that's your only way of communicating with us, are you able to make a dark shadow right near us so we can all see and know that you're here? That would be really appreciated and we'd love to, to know that you're around us. At least we're getting some kind of reaction. Yeah, I just don't feel right over there. Don't you? No. In what way? I don't know. It's like all the actions happening over Jonathan's side. Did you? Know. Have you just moved, Lee? No, I've not even. Did I'm you just... see that shadow go right over to Jonathan then? I sure did. Thank you for that. Just want to move over here. No. no. Right, <laughs> Do you want to move over here? Yeah. Come on. Okay then. Which, which side do you want to move? Do you want to move to the left or the right of me? <sighs> what we'll do then is... Um, I'll move because I want to get, I want to be in the middle. And that's not me being like frightened of it. Well, okay, fair enough. If you sit there, Jonathan, it's only so we've Can got... I sit next to Lee? Yeah, it's fine. I was going to say we want to get this in 3D audio. 
Why don't you swap seats with Jonathan? Yeah, for five minutes and then try it that way. Do you want me to try it? Yeah, give it a whirl. Yeah, great. What Thanks. I hear the bump then. Yeah. Yeah, you two swap seats then and then. I see the way you say you two swap seats. Isn't there yeah, you volunteer in there? You're the one with the earphones and you're the boss. Oh, yeah. Cool. There's that thud again. Shipping on me. Oh yeah. Yeah, swap seats. Yeah. See if you can pick anything up over there, Jamie. Seriously. Go on. You'll be alright. Alright, so I'll do 30 seconds. Because if it's acting to your voice while you're speaking to Jonathan. Okay. Then it might come over this side. Okay, so I've swapped seats with Jonathan reluctantly. I've now got Jonathan and Lee in front of me. Just say where you are, Lee. I'm on your right. And Jonathan. I'm on your left. But to me, Lee's on the left and Jonathan's on the right because they're facing opposite me, obviously. So we swap seats. This one's quite warm, actually. I just hope you haven't wet yourself. No. <laughs> my legs are shivering. Yeah. I've never known us to be so serious and I'm just trying to relax, but you... you there's no relaxing tonight, is there? No. Do you want to call out again? I'm yeah, sure, okay. but I'm not yeah. cold. Yeah. I'm going to ask if there's somebody here with us now. If that's your shadow and you're able to come towards us, that's your way of showing us that you're here. If you can come towards us and communicate with us, we'd love to know that you're here. Are you able to come forward again, please? Just for for the show, um, we're now looking at the floor more than anything else, aren't we? Because that's yeah. where the movements are actually happening. And I know some people will be going, well, it's probably your own shadow. It certainly isn't because um, I can't see. The only shadow I can see is Jonathan's, and that's going to the left, and it's not moving. Lee's dark anyway, where he's sitting, and I can't see a single shadow off him. Um, can any of you see my shadow anywhere? Just on your bottom of your feet, that's all. Yeah, just, yeah, just one of your feet. Okay, so we, we're aware of where our shadows are. Um, does one of you want to give a call out? Or? Uh, yeah, Let's try and stop my legs from shaking. Mm -hmm. uh, it's okay. If the, if the person that came forward before, would you like to come forward again? Come and show yourself. Would you like to tell us your name? Can you tell us why you're here? Past this building? Have you come with someone? Have you been brought in? I'm getting colder by the second now. It don't mean you any harm. I'm just here to speak to you, to find out your story. Burn taps. I know I can hear water dripping in the distance to me right. Mm -hmm. Okay, shadow to me left just then. Just saw a movement. Right, whatever it is, it's, it's back. If this is you again, thank you for coming back forward. We appreciate it. We know now. We now know that this is the only way you're going to be able to communicate with us. Well, we hope there's another way as well. But if you can, and you're able to, can you move again so we can see your shadow? It's. 
it's weird isn't it that you can see something like a shadow my back has just gone really cold and I'm my back shadow right where? There, to your seriously yes, yes you're right I was going to say it's funny how you see a shadow but you can't see the person mm. how a it shadow seems, it seems too low to be a person mm. but how does a shadow develop without yeah true something being there do you get what I mean yeah it's quite a long shadow yeah it is thank you for coming forward thank you for showing us that you're here My neck's going really cold. It's freezing now. My feet are like ice. Right, give a description on how, how both of you feel, starting with Lee. My leg from like, the bottom of my feet to my knees are like ice. And how are you feeling in yourself? Very nervous. Like, on an edge. More, Did anybody more see the normal. shadow yes. then? Yeah, so right between us. Yeah. Yes, I saw that. That was very, very dark. Yeah. Thank you. I keep going like cold with goosebumps when that happens then. Yeah, I've got the goosebumps. Yeah. Jonathan, how are you feeling? Uh, same as Lee, really cold. Feet up. Yeah. I'm edge constantly next to my cheek. What was that? What was what? I had a growl. Really can't stop me like shaking. And are you feeling in yeah. yourself? You know, I mean, I'm feeling nervous. I'm feeling nervous, but that was my foot. Uh, Sorry, I had an itch. But calm as well, if you know what I mean. It's, yeah. I yeah. don't think it means any harm. No. I don't think I feel. Um, I don't feel we're in, in any kind of threatened um, situation. I just can't keep still. Mm. I've just seen something to my left, like a shadow that has moved to my left on the floor. <clears throat> the person who's here now with us, thank you so much for what you're doing. We didn't expect this this much from you. We just thought we'd see one kind of movement or possibly nothing. But yeah, seem to be wanting to communicate with us or walk near us, and that's great. If you're able to hear us or able to see us, can you walk between us now? If it, the only way you can walk between us is shown as your shadow, please do so, so we can we know that you can hear us or see us. Are you able to do that for us, please? Are you able to communicate with us in any way at all, whether it's like knocking on something, moving something? It's funny how tense you feel. Does one of you want to try and call out again? Yeah. If there's anybody here, can you let us know that you're here? Can you tap on something? Can you move something? Can you show yourself in shadow form for us again? Do anything you can in your own way to let us know that you're here. We've seen you a couple of times now, in shadow form, on the wall, or going past. Can you do that again for us? We don't mean you any harm or disrespect. We just want to communicate with you. There's definitely something round, isn't there? Yeah.
you, have you found that you're a bit nervous about wanting to look to the left or to the right or? To the right. Yeah. Uh, or towards the stairs. Yeah. Yeah, I'm like that. I've just turned slightly then. What about you, Jonathan? Um, I don't know. I feel a bit calmer, to be honest. Hmm. Right, shadow to your left, Jonathan, on the table, on my right, your left, on your side. Okay. Um, between the table and the thing what's behind you. Okay. Are you coming close again? We don't mind you coming close at all. As long as you respect us as we are respecting you. Go ahead, keep going, Jonathan. Right, okay. Before you start, Jonathan. Go on. From my left, Lee's right. I'm just in the shadow. Go across and stop near, near Lee then. Okay. I don't know where it went from there. What's that noise? Sorry, go ahead, John. Do you have an interest in why we're here? Are you looking for us like we're looking for you? Sorry, that's my belief, Rumble. Can you see us? Can you come between us? Show us your shadow between us if you can see us or you can hear us. Can you do that? What was that? Oh, I'm really cold. Mm -hmm. What was that? Where? Is that you? What? Don't know you. What was that? What was that? It was like a. I don't know what it sounds like, I just don't want to hear it. I'm going bitterly cold. That's what I was going to say, I was going to say, I don't know, I just had nothing. I was just watching like to the right here for the shadow on the floor. Is that you that made that noise? Can you make that noise again please? Can I ask why you walk in this hallway? It feels like it's building up to something. Yeah. I'm not in the rooms. It feels like, um, I don't know how you'd say it, but you know when you can hear static? Mm -hmm. I can hear it's like static. Yeah. You know like when you've left your tape, TV on and it's mm. like a white noise? It's very, like loud. Like if someone's trying to build it up. He was building its energy up again. Yeah. Do you have to build your energy up to show us your shadow? Sorry. If that's what you have to do, 
I mean, really appreciate that. Yeah, the tap then. So oh, in no. that doorway. Which doorway? The one what you room you don't like. Well, I'll just keep looking towards you two. So it takes a lot for you to build your energy and do something. Anything to show us that you're here. We really appreciate that. With the greatest respect for you. All we want to do is make contact with you. And to know if you can hear or see us. So if you can, can you show yourself now please? Just to let us know. Come on, please come forward, come and talk to us. What was what? Right, well, I'll sat here now and then. What we'll do now, Lee, it's your turn to sit no, here. Right. <laughs> <laughs> so it's all right for me and Jonathan? Yeah. You're not going to sit here, no? No, definitely not. Just for the listeners, that's Lee Arnold. <laughs> <laughs> Coward of the county. <laughs> Me and Jonathan braved it. Yeah. And I think Lee should sit here the same as us. He's part of the team, he's part of us. Come on, let's shame him into it. Go on, Lee. Go on. Are you going to go for it? Yeah. <laughs> hey, it's a nice and warm seat. <laughs> hey, that's better. You can see us better though, can't you, from there? Yeah. I'll just move my chair a little bit. Lee, have you got thermals on this chair's red hot? I've got me tracksuit bottoms on, haven't I? I'm glad about that. I'm going to ask again if there's anybody here with us now, please come forward. We mean you no harm. Come and show us you're around. You've got Jonathan, Lee and myself, Jamie. Oh, Shadow. Where? Where's first that table? There. And on the wall. There. Can yeah. you see it? Yeah. Thank you for coming forward. Can you can you come closer? We don't mean you any harm. What was that? The funny thing is, is because we're recording this in binaural, yeah. it seems to be picking it up. I seem to be quite sensitive of what I'm hearing. Could you again please come forward? We don't mean you any harm. Are you reacting to my voice? If you are, and you can hear me, could I ask you to come forward again, please? There's only three of us here. And we're not here to ridicule you or make fun of you. Do you want to try calling out, Lee? From over there? Yeah. If there's anybody here, can you let us know where you are, please? Can you show us yourself in shadow form? You've done really well tonight with the shadows. Do anything you can in your own little way to let us know where that you are. I'm just wondering, you know, that. Do you remember me uh, when COVID started? Yeah. 
I have to come here on my own and, and do a, a build and check occasionally. Yeah. And if you remember, I came down here on my own with the lights on. Yeah. And I was up the top end, where I don't like, on the left hand side of me now. And um, in the cellar. Yeah. And I was standing there and I was, I, what I'd done is I'd done a bit of a recording on my phone and suddenly this huge black shadow went over me. And since then, we've, we've had these shadows and lots of people have seen these shadows. Mm -hmm. And I'm just wondering if it's, it's has been here for a very long time. It's just that the amount of people who were coming in here and everything else, it was like mixed with other people's shadows and things like that. So over COVID time and over the times where we've been doing the show in here, there's hardly been anybody in. So we're starting to get to see this shadow, we're starting to get to see it, the movements of it. Mm. Now, we definitely know it's not spiders. No. 100% this it's is not spiders. The way, the way it moves as well. Yeah. And if it was a spider, it'd be one big spider, wouldn't it? Yeah. Well, look at that nice it came from mm. that end. All the way down, we watched it go between us. Yeah. All the way down to the other end. And the number of people now who have seen this shadow. Yeah. No, it's not a spider. They've all seen it for themselves. What's that? Don't know. That sounds weird. Mm. What the hell? What was that? Thank you. That's, That's giving me a bit of nervousness of that. It was, I'm getting a bit thinking now. Nervous. Mm, yeah. What should we do? Should we go back up and have a go somewhere else? Can do. It yeah. just seems a bit unedgy. Yeah, I'm starting yeah. to feel the same, especially after that. Yeah. Okay, do you want to put your torch on while we go move to another place? Because that was, was not good. good. That was too much, wasn't it? That was, yeah, didn't like that. Oh, I hope the listeners heard that as well. It okay. Like it was in here though, did it? Where did it sound? I, I thought it was in there. I thought it was where the firing range was. Yeah. Do you think? Yeah. yeah. So I thought it was from upstairs. Well, what we'll do now is, do you want to go into the dormitories? We'll have a walk across to the dormitories. Yeah. And see what we can pick up there. Shall we get, grab a couple of cat balls? You shaking, Lee? No, it was me. Was that you? Were you shaking? Oh. Yeah, my, my legs have not stopped. Yeah, my legs are like ice on this chair. Okay, let's, let's not down move freedom. upstairs then, because... Um, um, yeah, shall we grab some cat balls? If we go to the yeah, we could do. What's that out of mask? That was... Um, what we've got to say, though, down in the cellar, that was not a comfortable... I know it sounds like we're being a bit of cowardice yeah. getting away from it, but that did not sound welcoming for tonight. Not nice so, but thank you for thank you for um, yeah, contacting with us. We do appreciate it. You two, all right? Yeah. You yeah. two look so serious. It's, it's just something to feel right. I know. Thank you. Um, I don't think them cat balls are working very well, Lee. We need no. to order some more. So. Should we just go straight just across and across, yeah. yeah? So what we're doing? Let's close that door. Yeah. I'll just close this door. Sorry, anyone's got their headphones on. Sorry about that noise. Unless we try near the studio. Should we get the studio? Because if you can hear us and you can see us, if you can see the bell. If you can make the bell ring, we'd appreciate that. Yeah, let's go to the near the studio. It's pretty cold down here, isn't it? Uh, let's go up. Tell you what, it's a bit watching here tonight in here, isn't it? What's wrong? What about it? You know when you push it open and let it go? Yeah. And it closes by itself. That's what I thought it was. Or was it the cellar door? Just have a look. It's open. 
It's war. She's going to go back down again. Let me have a look at the cellar door because I know how far I've closed it as well. Yeah, that's okay, that's how I closed it. Yeah, yeah. It was just way down here, that door. Yeah. So that's my car key, sorry. Do you two feel like me a little bit on edge now? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, let's go back up. So should we do one just up here on the um, balcony. on the balcony? Yeah. Remember last time we done it up here. That we time stuff, we? we did. Okay, let's go for it up here. Oh, so one sit there, one sit here, yeah. one sit here. I tell you what, you can tell winter's setting in, can't you? Can or autumn. Okay. All right, Leah. Yeah, I'm just turning me to try to. How are you feeling, Jonathan? Yeah, a bit better now. A bit better now up here. Oh, dear, me. <sighs> that was very intense. It got, it got more intense, especially after that noise. More than weird. Yeah. Okay. We're going to ask you if there's anybody here now on the balcony where we're sitting or in the main hall here at Mill Street Barracks. If you could walk towards us, can you walk, stamp your feet, or march? Please do so. If you wish to, and you are able to, ring the bell. Let us know you're here by ringing the bell in the main hall. Still feels a bit strange even up here. Mm. I all of a sudden, as was okay a second ago, I have just gone literally freezing. I'll start shivering in a minute. Do you want to call out Jonathan? Yeah. Is there anybody up here with us now? If there is, could you make a sound? That's people outside, walking past the building. Yeah. I think you've gone. Is there um, anybody in, on, on the main deck? If there's anybody up on this balcony with us? Can you make a sound? Can you tap? Can you bang? Can you copy me? Can you move something? Sure, I don't know. Copy me. <whistles> I am really, really cold. What about you, Jonathan? John, not too bad. Not as bad as it was on the side. Probably. See, I was alright on that other chair. Yeah. 
but when I was sat next to Jonathan in the chair where he was, it was like as if I put my ice, it hurt my legs in a block of ice. Oh, it's cold up here. This is the coldest I've been all night. Mm. I mean, I've, it, it, it's like a pure winter's night here tonight for some reason. It is. Been here and it's been freezing. Cold. Oh god, yeah. I'm not shivered like that. And we've got fleeces on as well, that's the thing. Yeah, I'll tell you what we'll do, we'll give it another minute or two and we'll head back into the um into the studio because I am literally freezing my off. <laughs> <laughs> Just about careful what I was about to say then. It's been a it's been a bit of a strange one, this hasn't it? It has. Certainly has. Oh, I'll tell you what. Forget about the two minutes. I think we'll start heading back into it. It's, it's only there the studio, but I'm starting to shiver too much. Um, but it's quiet up here anyway, isn't it? It is. So let's come on. Let's go back into the cellar. Not the cellar. It's the cellar. So See you later. Hey, what was that? <laughs> Oh, yeah. Oh, I, will, I really hope they've enjoyed that because. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Oh. It's a bit better in here, isn't it? I think it's got a small room. It's a bit better in here. Mm -hmm. You just put the, put the heater on, haven't you? Yeah, too right. Yeah. Put the heater on for a little bit. I think we need that. Oh. So that cellar was really strange. Let me just get back onto the studio microphones and everything else. Um, let's move across onto the studio microphones, uh, Jonathan and Lee. Yeah. Because what we'll do then is. Um, okay. Oh, God, I am so cold. Uh, the things we do for the show, eh? <laughs> right, so what I'm going to do now is, is we're going to head back onto the studio microphones. So we should be now onto the. He's put them. Oh, we're going to get on the studio now is it like a, a loud noise so uh, we're back on the studio so you can take your headphones off if you wish now and I uh, hope you enjoyed that um, investigation because oh, I know, we enjoyed it but like you said Lee, it, it was absolutely yeah. freezing it's so cold oh I know I'll tell you what I'm going to do I'm going to play the advert while we warm up a little bit. So, yeah. um, here's our information on how you can get in touch with us. So, uh, <laughs> please get in touch with us. Tell us what you think of um, our little escapade into the cell there. Let us know if you heard anything. We'd appreciate it. So, this is how you can make con make contact with us. Jamie and Jonathan always love to hear your spooky paranormal experiences and stories. Why not get in touch with them directly on email at info.accessparanormal at gmail.com. That's info.accessparanormal at gmail.com. Alternatively, you can leave a message on the studio mobile phone. The number is 07828 206. Now, Jamie and Jonathan may get back in touch, but it will be a voicemail, so if you do have anybody answer, who knows who's on the other end of the telephone line. <laughs> so before we carry on um, a friend of mine John Scotland put a, a statement up on, on Facebook and what it says is I'll tell you what instead of me trying to explain it I'll just read what he put yeah. um, so what, what John put up was please don't become a victim I have recently received a number of people who have been told in readings that they have been hexed or cursed. Don't listen. I truly believe they simply want you as their cash cow. Don't give them any money. This is preying on vulnerability. There seems to be two people who are spreading the poisonous poison both offer. I don't know what that means. They are offering free readings on Facebook to hook people in and take, please take care. 
So it seems like there's a couple of people going on there doing readings, telling them they've got a hex. And yeah. I, I assume that the same well, we can get rid of it for the price. Yeah. yeah. So yeah. if you get that, don't listen to them. Please be very careful. We'd hate you to be caught out by scammers yeah. and yeah. con men and things like that. So I just thought I'd put that out there because um, I think it's important. Yeah, definitely. Especially in this day and age with technology as well. Oh, yeah. So, um, yeah, going back to the the actual recording we just did where we've done it in 3D. Mm. There's a couple of things in there, really. You know, let's let's have a little pick of the bones. Sorry, I'm just moving the mouse while I'm talking That's to you. All right. <laughs> yeah, get used to it because um, you know what I'm like. Yeah. But, the, the, you know... Apart from that, th I mean, we went down there, and, and you said something, Jonathan, before we went down, didn't you? That's it, yeah. Because uh, you asked us what we were expecting. Yeah. yeah. Um, and I said movement, didn't I? Mm. Um, and we definitely got some movement down there. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And, and Lee, how did you feel? It was, um, I don't, I don't, it was different atmosphere. Mm. Yeah, it didn't feel right. No. At first, we were okay going down yeah. there. We were chatting yeah. and, and yeah. you know sorting ourselves yeah. out. But as soon as we started, it was, yeah. it was it, the atmosphere changed. Oh. I've never felt it so cold on my my leg. The mm. whole time we were down there, my legs were shaking. Yeah. Yeah, because you were sat on the opposite side to us, weren't you as well? Yeah. Well, yeah, I was sat on that chair. Yeah. Well, the the first thing that happened was the shadow. Yeah, and it went towards Jonathan. It did. Not once, but a couple of times, because yeah. yeah. one went in front of him, and we both saw it. Yeah, we saw it. Yeah. Now, Lee, obviously, Jonathan was sitting opposite us, and then I had to go in the chair. Yeah, and then sitting in the chair, I saw that shadow, and it came to you. It did. So it it was just a bit. I, I can't, you can't even explain it to be honest no, with you. No. And then Lee had to go with it, didn't he? Yeah. Yeah. And the same thing happened with Lee. Yeah. It's weird. You know, but it was, again, it was a different, completely different atmosphere. It was. It was very, very strange, wasn't it? Yeah. And, and there was that strange noise. Yes. Oh, yeah. Noise, yeah. Yeah. Um, I know there was a couple of noises, but that one in particular. The, like, growl. Yeah. And that was just before we, well... We didn't just before we we decided that was that was enough in yeah. the cellar. Yeah, I don't know whether it was a chair moving or it was yeah. a growl or it was just. Don't know. We sort of like heard a bit of. Um, it's like as if somebody was trying to speak as well. Mm -hmm. That was weird. But that was when we were coming up the stairs. Yeah. Yeah. And the, the, I mean, everyone knows this show's recorded, and um, as we were coming up the stairs, we were listening to it. Yeah. As we were as we were putting it into the show. Yeah. And you just hear on the stairs, don't you? Because I'm talking, I just said something to you to the next minute, you hear, yeah, or something like that. Yeah. Go across the microphone. Now, we listened to that all, six it? or seven times, didn't we? And it was clear. Yeah, you no, could hear it. And then I thought it was you, Jonathan. Yeah. But then we realised it wasn't. No, it wasn't, because I was, I was at the back. Mm. I was further down the stairs. Yeah. Still coming up. Um, and even then, it was such... It was like it was like a yeah, wasn't it? Yeah. But it was like a definitely yeah. But like went carried out itself on. Yeah. It, it went on for yeah. A few seconds. I mean, all right, it was probably only a few seconds, but it was really mm. long. And it, it, I mean, I must have the first thing you said was that you, Jonathan. Then when we listened to the whole thing, mm. you were quite a distance behind us. Yeah, because I speak just after it, only a couple yeah. of seconds after, and uh, you're further away I than further than that back. sound. It's like as if it was mocking you. Mm. Yeah. But then. Yeah. When we came up here and we were putting it into the show, now this is that that cut, um, sorry, that investigation we've just done then was in 3D and it is uncut. We haven't edited it in any way. Yeah. All we've done is edit it into the show. And when we were doing it, we were listening to it, and you hear me shutting the door of the, the cellar. Yeah. And I said, I turned around and said, something just swore then. It was as clear as anything to swear. Because as I shut the door, you heard the f word, yeah. you know, and we played it back a f several times again to see if we could hear it. Nothing. It wasn't there. So the only conclusion we can think of of that was it was in our headphones again. Yeah. yeah. 
I know you didn't hear it. Well, well you I both didn't hear it. No, no, I didn't. But I heard it in my headphones, and I turned around and said, was that swear? Because I thought, I'm going to have to edit that out, because obviously, you know. Oh, yeah. And yeah. If, if, you know, in future shows, we have pre- I have recorded something for the show, a, a special one. Yeah. And there is a couple of swear words in that one, so I'm just a one and a head. I can't edit it out because of the way it was. Yeah. But that... I mean, that was a really good. It was so intense, though, at mm. the time there. Yeah. yeah, which it was, you know. It was like, I mean, it's on investigations here for many years now. Freezing cold, middle of winter yeah. and everything. Mm. I've not shivered like that before. No. You could tell we were alone. Yeah. You we could, and there. before... Like at one point, something went... You moved, didn't you? You said you thought you felt something at the back of you. Mm, and then that's we right. see the shadow we come out the yeah, other side. Yeah. yeah. And I can't see behind me. No. But there was five or six people, maybe seven people went down before us, an hour or so before yeah, us exactly. anyway, because they were, they were doing a little... Um, they like the say, open circle, and then they yeah. come along when the, the building's quiet and they go down and do a little bit yeah. of practice. So whether it was from there, I don't know. Well, they didn't. They asked us, didn't we? We were upstairs, and they said to us, "Did you come down and throw a pen?" Yeah, and none of right. that. Yeah. We'd stayed in. We were in. We were in the wardroom now. In the wardroom, yeah. 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 So there's only them down there, and yeah. we all swore blind that they did not do it. Some of them yeah. were in a, a room, the boiler room, which are closed, yeah. and the others, the door was closed, but they had a pen thrown. Yeah. Well. It's the end of the show, and what we've got to do is we've got to say thank you to Lewis and Louise for coming to with us with on the cemetery, Jonathan. Yeah. And also, it's nice to see Lee in the studio again. Thanks for coming in, Lee, and thank you. going on our little ghost hunt. And I hope everybody enjoyed the two investigations today. But tune in next week because next week it's our Halloween special, yeah. four hours of this show, live investigation. So we'll see you then. Good night. Good night. And good night.